last year when he finished in 20th position in the overall standings. And Hadley Michael now being called to roll back through on the other side. Just an indication perhaps of a change of the wind direction to make sure they're as efficient as they can possibly be. so far today but there's a problem for the Eritreans I just saw two feet out on the left hand side of the road and one of the riders from that squad has had a mechanical problem and this is not good news because it's fact it's Tezfazi on number 195 Natnel Tezfazi on the man that they've been working for who's had a front wheel puncher and waiting to assist him is Habdi Michael who's not just playing the role of team helper he's also the team mechanic Spot for Tez Fazzi on. This is no good. The speed is just way too high. It was 6.4. Oh, no. Go. The Eritreans, great maturity. They've lost Tez Fazzi on with that front wheel puncher. They're turning their attention now to Debesay. 
For a show of strength, the Eritreans now coming to the front. They have full faith in Nat Neil Tezbazi. <laughs> in front of Kennett to protect him. Smith doing a good job. It is still Marco Minar who's at the front for Wanty Group Goubert. The orange jersey sits in fourth position. That is Boris Vallee. Directly behind him is Jakob Marechko. Tiz Fazion is also in the mix for Eritrea. Now opening up the sprint, it's Wesley Crater. They get through the corner safely. Crater is at the front. Willia Tristina are next in line. It is then Valet, followed next in line by Marechko. Tizvazion is waiting, but he's having a little bit of the push and shove. The sprint is being opened up. This is Mosca who is on the front. Valet is waiting. Marechko goes early. The Italian Bullets has opened up the gap. It's going to be a matter of just how far for Marechko. Magnificent victory for the Italian. Makes it look comfortable. Marechko convincing. Well, that's the best he's looked. There was never any doubt once he got his nose in front. Winning ahead of Chima with Tesfazi on in third. Valet was fourth. Bonifacio ran in out the top five. Third. And the celebration behind from Mosca, the man who did the lead outs. Jakob Marechko winning the stage. Emerio Chima in second position. Nat Neil Tesfazion in third. He's made the podium. Well done. Valet in fourth, Bonifacio in fifth, it was then Ziga German in sixth, followed by Buglas, Habtom, it was then Lopez and Okamoto. Two riders from the Eritrean team inside the top ten, showing the depth and strength of that team. This is the Eritrean, Nat Neil Tezfazion. Up onto the podium for the first time, he had a fourth place finish a few days ago, a frustrating puncher yesterday, third place today. Pocket Rocket from Italy. The medal's been presented by one of the local dignitaries. Marechko has enough experience on this podium to be able to provide everybody else there with the instructions of how it's done. Marechko, Chima, Tezfazio. Of all the African nations with their growing strength in cycling, it is the Eritreans who are leading the way. South Africans, particularly with Daryl Impey, have got strong representation. Likewise with uh, Van Rensburg as well, out of South Africa. But the depth in numbers from Eritrea at that next level down, about to burst onto the world stage, really is impressive. Thank you.